the media is a tricky thing to handle. On one hand, it's important to stay informed and be abreast of all the things that's going on around you. But then on another hand, too much information and information that's maybe predatory or has clear ulterior motives can be detrimental. This episode of The Bigger Picture focuses on one of the first men to battle predatory news and fake news in America, John Russworn. After becoming just the second African-American to earn a college degree, he met up with a minister named Samuel Cornish and developed the first black American newspaper, Freedom's Journal. Russworm and Cornish were tired of people misrepresenting them in the media and not allowing black people to speak for themselves. So they positioned Freedom's Journal to do two things. First, they saw Freedom's Journal as a way to uplift black people and give them a reason to be proud of their heritage and their culture. And then two, Freedom's Journal was meant to defend black people in the media space by providing an alternative perspective on what black people were going through and how black people should be treated. So with his partner, right, John Brustworm was able to cement a legacy in journalism and media at large by battling biased reporting in America. His work inspired the creation and development of black publications around the country and also inspired countless others by helping them see the bigger picture.